Hi and welcome to the Buddy Punch demo. Today I'm going to go over all the features available through Buddy Punch so you can confirm that we have what you need so you can go ahead with your free trial. If you do need a more detailed demonstration, please schedule that from our website. This is the login screen where all our user types access Buddy Punch. We have employees, managers, which are type of employees with admin capabilities, and administrators. All can use a username and password to log into the system. We also offer single sign-on from Google, Apple, and Intuit, as well as employee-only kiosk features where they can use a QR code or a four-digit PIN code to quickly access and punch in, punch out, or go on or off a break. Today, I'm going to show you the administrator's dashboard, which can allow me to show you the majority of the features in Buddy Punch. Over here, we have today's schedule, if you're using our scheduling add-on. Here's all the shifts that have been assigned today. Over here is our live punch board, where in real time, you can see who's punched in and who's punched out. In the demo system, I'm taking a photograph and a GPS point when they punch in and out so that I can confirm that's correct and they're where they're supposed to be. You can also manually punch people in and out of the system. So if someone's forgotten to punch in or punch out, you can do that for them. Over here, under pending approval, are all the requests that the administrator receives. Under punches, we can get requests for edit to time cards or auto punch out features, which automatically punches a user out after a certain amount of time. So this will capture anybody who's forgotten to punch out and let the administrator and managers know that their time card needs addressing. The second tab is our time off requests. You can approve them from the dashboard or drill down and see what the details are. You can see their original requests and we also offer a time off calendar where you can see everything in context. The third tab is the time card tab, another optional feature where you can have employees submit a time card at the end of the pay period and have them acknowledge that the hours are correct. Regardless of whether you use this workflow feature or not, you can view all the time cards here. Just grab the pay period you want to review and you can see the total number of hours right here on the top. We can turn columns on and off. We can drill down into the time card and review the details, make any adjustments we may need to make, step through each employee, go backwards and forwards in pay periods, whatever we need to do to review the time card. Our optional scheduling feature allows you to schedule shifts for your employees. These colored boxes show you shifts that have been published to the employees. The wireframes are schedules that are not published. That's the big difference between a scheduling system and a shared calendar. It's this ability to publish a calendar. Setting up new shifts is very easy. You can set a start time and an end time. You can color code items. You can set up repeats like weekly or weekdays or more complicated repeats like Monday, Wednesday and Friday. You can also track up to three levels of details along with the punch. When you're ready to publish, you can publish to everybody or just people with changes or people in the current view. You can notify them via email, you can push it through the app so it rings on their phone, or you can do both or neither. We also offer an availability calendar where an employee can tell you when they're unavailable or when they prefer to work, either on an all-day basis or on individual times. This is easily seen by the scheduler. When they're doing the schedule, the unavailable is clearly indicated. And if you want to know if someone prefers to work that day, just scroll your mouse over the particular day and the preferred times will pop up. Additional options include copying schedules across multiple weeks, as well as creating templates, which you can apply when the situation arises. Under employees, we can see all the employees that we have defined in the system, whether they're active or inactive. Inactive employees don't count against your headcount, but all the data stays in the system. We can drill down here, 
we can see all the credentials which you're going to provide and then when you save the new employee it will send them a welcome email where they can get their username and password and also a short introductory video. All the data is listed in here, including the ability to set up different time off codes and pay rates for the employees. Payroll is a new feature that we've added. If you need a specific payroll demo, please reach out and schedule that demo from our website. There is a robust reporting engine where we can see all kinds of information stored in the system. Using daily hours as an example, we can put in any start time, any end time, and then we can see all the data that was accumulated during that period. In this particular report, I'm showing each person what days they punched in and how many hours that they've accumulated. All our reports can be exported out to CSV or Excel files or PDF or even printed from the screen. We even have a very handy payroll export report where you can grab your pay period, run your report and get their total numbers of hours, which you can then export out to Excel. Settings covers all the setup features that are available in Buddy Punch. Account settings, general settings like time zones and such. Billing is your billing relationship with us. We offer integrations with a number of different accounting and payroll systems. Pay period is pretty self-explanatory. Scheduling options are available, so you can have various rules that you can set up for the scheduling feature. Again, this is a toggle feature because it's optional. Time entry allows you to set up timesheets for employees to fill out instead of tracking their start and end times. And this can be done on an individual basis. You can have an unlimited number of time off codes and separate accrual rules for each time off. This allows you to have everyone use the same time off code but accrue it at different rates. We support blackout dates, which are dates people can't take off, and a company calendar for holidays that everyone gets. Locations and departments are two codes that come with the basic system and positions comes with the scheduling add-on. This is data elements that you can add to punches so that you can do filtering and sorting later. I showed you that we can capture webcam photos or GPS, but we can also capture real-time GPS if you need to track your folks throughout the day. Additionally, we can restrict people to certain devices, to networks, or even set up geofences, wherein that is the only place that they can punch in and out. We have a robust alert and reminder system with many different triggers available to you. Alerts of things that have happened, reminders of things that are about to happen. We also have reminders explicitly for admins and managers. You can set up different breaks, including automatic breaks. We have a kiosk mode, as I mentioned earlier, which you can turn on and off. And this gives you a nice, clean, single place to manage everybody's pin. I mentioned you can set up different pay rates. You can limit people to when they can punch. You can do punch rounding. And I also talked about a time card approval setting earlier. So these are some of the features that are available with the Buddy Punch system. Now there is a complete knowledge base covering everything we've talked about today and so much more, over 30 videos in the knowledge base. There's even instructions explicitly for employees that show both the web and app version on how to do everything. But if anybody does get into trouble, there is this chat window here on every page of the website view and is even inside the app. When you're logged in as an admin, not only does it give you quick access to the knowledge base, but these aren't chatbots, but our system support personnel and our customer success manager. If it's normal business hours, central time, you can talk directly to a person who can see your data, who can see your account information and can help you out of any situation you may have gotten yourself into. So I hope you found this useful today. And again, if you do need more information, reach out either via the chat window or schedule a demo right from our website. Have a great day.